Hello, I'm Chris Fenton with Royal LePage Pacific Rim Realty, The Fenton Group, and I'm coming to you from my virtual office today to give you a real estate market update for June 2021. And in this market update, I'm going to go over two things with you. I'm going to look at the May 2021 statistics for the Greater Alberta Valley and compare them to May of the previous year. And then what we're going to do is we're going to look at a graph that we produced of median sale price month over month since the pandemic began. And I think we'll find this stuff interesting. So let's take a look at those first stats. Now, I want to point out that these are single family, non-waterfront homes that sold in the Greater Alberta Valley. So the Greater Alberta Valley includes Port Alberni, Sprout Lake, Beaver Creek, and Cherry Creek. So May this year, we've seen 48 new listings for homes come on the market, which is awesome because last May we saw 25. And we needed, we need inventory. We need more homes to go on the market so the market can become more stable. And that is a, a really, really nice development. This year we had 41 sales in May compared to 34 last year. So sales are of course up, but not to the same extent the new listings are up. And then the average list price this year was $500,905 compared to $401,150 last year. With an average sale price this year of $508,188. So the average listing was selling seven to $8,000 over the asking price. And last year, the average sale price was $387,950. Now, I want to caution that I don't believe that the average house actually increased in value 100000 in 12 months. It's increased a lot, but not probably not 100000 When we're dealing with sample sizes for a single month, we have 41 and 34 sales, respectively. It doesn't take, it can take a couple of small sales or a couple of large sales to skew the numbers somewhat. So we're not saying, we can, it's too small a sample size to say that there's been a $100,000 increase in the average home but it's certainly telling us that the market is it's going up. Now, the average days on the market is 24 days this May compared to 58 last year. So that, that's what we're seeing and that fits in perfectly well with what I would have predicted. Now, the next thing I wanna show you is historic sale price trends. This is also for the single family homes in the greater Alberta Valley, excluding waterfront. And I ran the number, sorry, the median sale price for homes since the beginning of the pandemic, which I used March, 2020. And you're seeing this graph in front of you. So you can clearly see an upward trend where the median sale price was in the low to mid 300s. And now we're hitting and getting close to that $500,000 mark. So what that's telling us is for pretty much every month in the last 12, 15 months, we're seeing every house increase in value. And this is why we're seeing one of the reasons we're seeing multiple bidding wars on almost every listing that we see come on the market because Buyers know that the next house that comes on the market a month from now, at this point, following the past trend, is going to be worth more money. So we don't know when that will last. We don't know how long it will last. Nothing lasts forever in financial markets. But at this point, there's a consistent trend that we can see. So that's it. I want to keep this short, but that's it for this month. If you have any questions about the real estate stats, the real estate market, drop them in the comments below or give us a call 250-723-8786. We love to talk real estate. This is Chris Fenton with Royal LePage Pacific Rim Realty, the Fenton Group. We'll see you next month.